Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to normalize your audio using Femora Trail. And I will also show you how to synchronize your audio. All right, so this is my Femora Trail. And my first tip for those of you who want to improve your audio is to buy a new microphone, okay? No matter what it is, USB microphone or wireless, microphone or stuff like that it is better than the built-in microphone in your camera or your phone it is much better okay to improve your audio all right so by the way this is the example timeline and you can hear this is the first section with a high volume and the other section low and the other section is high and this is low and let's listen to it okay so this is the intro hi guys welcome to another video on my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to normalize your audio using Femora Trail. And I will also show you how to synchronize your audio. By the way, this is an improved audio. All right, so in order to normalize your audio inside Femora Trail, it is very simple. All you need to do is to select all of them. Okay, select all the video that has audio inside. And then you want to right click here, and then you want to select this option, adjust audio okay and now you have two options auto normalization and audio ducking and now all you need to do is to enable this option auto normalization okay and now we have an ai tools inside femora trail and it will normalize your audio and let's listen to it so here's the result hi guys welcome to another video on my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to normalize your audio using femora trail and i will also show you how to synchronize your audio by the way, this is an improved. All right, so that is how simple you can normalize your audio inside Vimora Trail. By the way, if you see the audio level is not what you need, you can adjust the audio level also. Okay, so in order to do that, for example, I want to adjust the audio level of all the video here or this video track, right? We need to use the audio mixer right here. Okay, so select this option, audio mixer. Okay, and here you will have the video, audio, and audio number one. So this is video number one. And let's play it. Hi guys, welcome to another video. And now you want to increase or reduce the volume of this track. You want to just adjust this slider. For example, I can make it maybe five decibel. We can input the number here. And then we can play on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to normalize your audio using Femora Trail. That's nice, right? And we can even reduce the volume of this video track, maybe minus 8 or minus 10. And I will also show you how to synchronize your audio. By the way, this is an improved audio with some background music. Okay, for example, I can make it like 6 decibel and then I can play. Okay. Hi guys, hey. welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to normalize your Okay, so that's nice, right? And now we can click apply to increase or reduce the volume of that video track. And being mentioned that you can also adjust the sound pattern here. You can go with stereo or surround. By the way, it will affect everything on the timeline. Even with this master slider, you can also adjust the audio of the timeline with this slider. Okay, so for now, we can just click apply. Okay, so this is how you can normalize your audio inside Filmora Trail. And let's click OK. And what if you have a background music down here and you have a talking video like this? For example, I can go back to my media and then I can have a music file. So this one, for example, I can just put it right here on the timeline and listen to the video. Okay. Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to normalize your audio using Filmora Trail. So you can see that my voiceover and the background music is kind of mixing together. And now we need to use the audio ducking feature, okay? So the one that you have just seen at the beginning, okay? We want to select everything on the timeline and then we want to right click and select adjust audio. And now we want to enable this audio ducking, okay? And we keep it 50%. It will lower the volume of all the, the track below the video by 50%, okay? And let's listen to it. Hey guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to... 
I think it's better, but normally I would select 65 for my video. Okay, so you can do the same. Uh, let's click OK. I want to show you how to normalize your audio using Femora Trail. And I will also show you how to synchronize your audio. By the way, this is an improved. Alright, so this is how you can normalize your audio and also how to use the audio ducking feature in Filmora 12. And now I'm going to show you how to synchronize the audio. If you record a video and the audio separately, okay, or you have multiple camera angle. Alright, so let's delete everything on the timeline first. Okay, and right now I have another microphone on my shirt. Okay, so this is the wireless microphone. It is Comica Vimo C, which is a very good wireless microphone. It has a box like this for battery. It's very good, okay? And now we are going to have another camera angle here for the mobile phone. So this is my iPhone. I'm going to hit the recording. And now you have two audio sources, the first one on your mobile phone, and the other one is from this microphone or from my main angle here. All right, so in order to synchronize it, we have to bring all of them into Filmora, okay? All right, so now I'm back to my Filmora trial. So first thing, I want to import the video from my Canon 800D first. So I'm going to click import here, and then I want to select my folder. Okay, so this is the video from my camera. Okay, and for the video from the iPhone, I'm going to import it directly here. By the way, I'm going to create a new folder so we don't mess up with the the other video okay so here i'm going to click import and import from a camera or a phone then i'm going to select my iphone scanning i'm going to click cancel to stop scanning other other video okay okay so i'm going to disable this one because we don't want to download this video i already downloaded to my computer okay because we have to disable all of them to save our memory and I want to just download this one because this is a video I need okay just disable this one so we can just click OK because it is only three five I'm going to click OK all right so now we have three video in my folder okay so this is the one that we are going to use by the way we want to go back to the this folder to the main folder and this is the video from my camera I'm going to put it on the timeline and then select the video from my iPhone and this one. Sometimes I have one. No, this one. This one because I have Keep a microphone. Recording. Okay, so I'm going to put this on track number two. And now we have two audio sources. The first one from my microphone, from this one. And the other is from my iPhone. By the way, I want to synchronize them. Okay, so let's listen to the first one. This is the first one. Now you have two audio sources, the first one on your mobile phone and the other one is from this mic. Okay, and this is the audio from this one, from my camera. Okay, and right now I have another microphone on my shirt. Okay, so this is the wireless. Alright, so in order to synchronize them, we want to separate the audio from this microphone first. Okay, so we want to right click and select detach audio. And now we want to just select the audio here and the video on the timeline and then we want to right click and select auto synchronization. So this is how you can synchronize your audio with the video in Filmora 12. Okay, just click here and it will synchronize and line up the video and the audio at the right position. Okay, so here's the right position and we want to then move the video to this position. Okay, and now we can disable this one and see. So this is my iPhone. I'm going to hit the recording. And now you have two audio sources. The first one on your mobile. Nice, right? For example, I can split this video and disable this clip. Okay, and now we can see this is a video. Okay, so let's move it right here. So we have two camera angle now. So this is my iPhone. I'm going to hit the recording and now you have two audio sources the first one on your mobile phone and the other one is from this microphone or from my main angle here. All right. So in order. 
Okay, so that is how to synchronize your audio using Filmora 12. By the way, you have multiple camera angle here, and if you want to see your B-roll, you want to just split the B-roll here and enable the clip like this, and you have two angle. Okay, so something like this. So this is multiple camera angle editing technique in Filmora 12. Here, all right. So in order to synchronize it, we have to. Okay, and we can disable this one and go back to the main camera angle. Bring all of them into Filmora. Okay. Alright, so that is enough for today's video. I hope it is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.